All right, hi everyone. Welcome back to another video of Salesforce Makes Sense. This is Himanshu, and we have started our Lightning Web Components Masterclass. We have done some chapters which are more like just you know beginner-friendly explainers of understanding where we are at. And now, what I want to talk to you about are certain questions that you really have. Do I need to know Aura or JavaScript for this? Right. So. I would like to ensure that you already know answers to these questions and so that you know what to expect and why am I here and why are you here and is it making sense to you, is it important for you and all of that stuff. So I'll just clear the air uh, air around it. So do you need to know Aura or JavaScript for it? For this I've actually listed down certain points and we'll actually look at them one by one. Okay. First point you don't need to learn Aura, it's not a prerequisite so that's a plus point. For those of you who do not know Aura, you don't have to worry. Okay, and for those of you who know Aura, it's fine. Okay, it's fine. So even if you have never touched Aura, this course is designed to teach you everything from scratch. You don't really need Aura. That's the first thing. Okay. The second thing is Lightning Web Components does not rely on Aura. It relies on JavaScript concepts like variables, loops, arrays, event handling, objects and all of that stuff. So there's no dependency with Aura. However, there's, an, there's a dependency with JavaScript. So what have I done? I've included an introduction to the key JavaScript concepts that you will need. Okay, it's not a JavaScript tutorial. Okay, so if you have a business where you sell mobile phones, uh, you don't really need to know how the mobile phone hardware has been created. You just need to know how to sell it. Correct. So you just need to know the key JavaScript concepts that you will need and you can start learning LWC even as a beginner. Okay, I hope that clears another question. Okay, so you won't need Aura, but you will need JavaScript and whatever JavaScript you will need, I'm going to teach you that. That's why I'm here for, right? Great. Familiarity with Salesforce, like, you know, standard objects and, you know, basics about Salesforce, you know, how our objects work, understanding a bit of Apex, that would be very helpful. Admin tools, flows, uh, understand, knowing a bit of Apex, the database. If you know that, that's really good. That's really helpful. That will help you understand the business context easily okay of how you want to apply lightning web components so that's a good thing to have you don't need to be a javascript expert to start just bring your curiosity and i'll teach you along the way okay me just showing off that you know i'll teach you everything you don't have to worry about anything all the headache is mine i'm just kidding you also keep some headache all right but yeah you don't have to be a javascript expert I'll teach you the key concepts and that should be enough. All right. The idea behind certain things in life is not to put your head too much inside it. Okay. Just see whether it is fruitful or not. Yeah. Okay. Fine. I'll just pick these three skills up and that's all I need to use. You don't have to put your head in any in the entire thing and then to put pull all of it out. You don't need to do that. Okay. So you will learn both JavaScript and LWC together. So for those of you who do not know JavaScript, who does not know LWC, who does not know Aura, it's okay. We are going to learn JavaScript and LWC together. There's no pipeline here that I need to first. A lot of people tell me, Imanshu, do I need to learn JavaScript first? Which course should I pick up? Where do I find JavaScript tutorials? Should I start from scratch from the very basic? People like to, you know, put it on their notes, put it, start from the very basic, let A equal to one and do hello world on JavaScript. Then after six years come to LWC, let's not do that. Whatever you need from JavaScript, I'll teach you alongside LWC. Okay. And that is enough. So we'll start small, I'll build your coding confidence, I'll keep asking you this, you'll tell me how your confidence is going around and we'll gradually accomplish and get you know into the big ocean of opportunities. Alright, in a very quick nutshell, Aura is not required, JavaScript is helpful if you know it already and coding is nice to have. When I say coding, I mean Apex and rela uh, other related coding experience if you have. It is a nice to have, but if you don't have it, it's okay. Uh, you'll have to uh, try to make sense of everything I explain. Okay, and JavaScript, if you already know, it's helpful. But if you don't, I am going to put out a set of tutorials before we start LWC. All right, great. That's the second time this picture is coming up. Do tell me in the comments how this photo looks compared to the previous one. Uh, just, just for fun, you know, nothing serious. So yeah, that's me. And uh, that's all I wanted to cover. I hope our key questions around Aura versus JavaScript versus LWC is covered and you are sorted in your head that you know what you need. Alright, great. That's all for this particular tutorial. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.